Hey traders, John Hal here. In this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about the stock market, what's really going on right now in the Dow Jones, S&P, and also the NASDAQ. What's really, really, really going on, okay? Guys, do not play straight based on what you're seeing in this video. Trading is risky and it can cause substantial financial loss. There's no guarantees of making money in the markets and be smart about the way that you're trading. And this video here is educational only. Okay, guys, make sure you get your free 12 hour trading course. It's 10 videos long, mindset, trading systems, trading chart reading techniques, first thing in the description. Let's go straight into it, guys. Now, what do I see here on the on the Dow Jones? Now, firstly, guys, let me actually bring this up here, okay? What I want you to do is when you're trying to read what the market is telling you right now, okay, is I want you to take everything off the screen and just bring it, bring it back to black bars, all right? So if you bring it back just to black bars, and all you're doing is you're trying to analyze or you are analyzing where is the strength in moves and what is happening right now in the market? So if we, if, if you, if you, and if you look what I'm, if you hear what I'm saying there, right? Always read what the market is telling you and not what you think, hope or fear. So what I mean by that is this, right? If we have a look at this here, we can see that the, we start, let's start back here back in late December. The market ran up, then it ran down, then we ran up. We had a little, little bit through that, didn't we? That bit there came back down. So it came that it double bottom, then it cra came up, made a lower high, then it made a higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, lower low. So at this point right here, who's in control? No one, right? No one. So then something what happened is we really just had this big move up through here, right? We had little pullbacks, but not significant pullbacks. And then what happened? We actually came down and we created a slide or even a double bottom through here. We ran up and now we're coming back down through to here. So if you look at what the market is telling you right now, what is the market telling you? We had a double bottom or slight lower low followed by a lower high. That simply means that tells us that if we break below the lows of this level through here, then that's likely to then continue falling through and falling on the downside. So that's what the market is telling us right now. And this whole thing here is one big, massive topping pattern. Let's go have a look at the S&P 500. Let's see what the S&P 500 is doing. Let's go back to the start. Again, this is just reading what the market is telling us, right? We have a move up and we have a point through here. A move up and then we have a point through there, right? See, see how these are significant pullbacks? And then what happened? We ran right up through here. And then what happened? We came down and we created what? This is a low this is a lower low now what did it do it came back up it created a high and now it's come back down to basically create like a bit of a double bottom to create a lower high so at this point right now if we look at let's bring up a tool let's bring up a, a frame all right if we look at let me bring up a different color here for a minute let's bring up a red here if we bring up a if you look at this if you look at this point from here to here, who is in control of the markets? Sellers, right? Why? Because we had a low, a lower low, and now we're having a lower, a lower, a lower high, especially when we start to break these lows through here. That means we have the sellers are in control. That means the market is rolling over into a downward trend. Let's go have a look at the NASDAQ here, All right? The NASDAQ is obviously one that you'd be really, really obviously See what see what's happening in the Nasdaq. Let's start from the bottom here. Rallied up, higher low, higher low, higher low, and then we had this basically we had a little little rally up through that, didn't we? And then when we come down, we ran down all the way down through here. So this low, where did this low? Let's go back to my green. Let's go back to you know what? Let's do this here, right? So this high low, high low. So this lower low eclipsed this one here and this one here. And even almost pretty much this one here as well too. So now what happened? We ran up, we made a, a a high, and now we're actually breaking a lower low. So it's actually broken the low here. So what is that? That's now what? This is a lower high. See how the market's rolling over? We went from a nice upward trend through here, as you can see, to now it's rolling over to a nice downward trend. We're creating, creating some sort of massive rounding top in these markets, creating a massive shoulder. Actually, you know what? Let me do this here. Creating a massive shoulder, a big head, and a, a right shoulder again as well too. Right, so now we actually can see we actually broke that low today. 
That tells us, guys, that the sellers are in control of this market. So, guys, right now, the top is starting to be formed right now. And the to me right now, the top is in. And when and, and now moving forward over the next two years, we're going to start to see the crash in the markets. Now, now, guys, when I say that, do not think the market's going to crash in one day. No, it takes 12 months to two years for a crash to unfold. 2008 was 2008. 2008 was it wasn't January of the first 2008 or the entire January of 2008. What was it? Gen 2008 was meaning from the start of 2008 to the end of 2008. What well, was a downward market? Okay. Now, just because you think just because you think this market is going to go down doesn't mean you should just get straight into the markets. And just because you think the market's going to go down doesn't mean you go start to short some other stocks because you think they're going to be correlated to the markets. No. Trade based on those individual stocks, what they see there as well too. So, stock market crash, guys. It's gonna. It's basically starting right now, as we see. We start to form this big top through here. Now, it, whether we get a big move down or we slowly start the trend down into next year, I don't know. But we are forming this massive top through here, guys. Is a top in the market, and over the next couple of years, we're going to see this market start to start start to unfold. Whether it's a strong move down or whether we just slowly move down like this here. Who knows? But the, the the bear market is now starting to be intact. Before you go, make sure you grab the free Grab the Markets by the Bullish training course. In this training course, you're gonna learn the top 13 deadly mistakes, the success formula, charting boundaries, the PT method, the ultimate trading system, the blast off trading system, number one in trading indicator, the mean dollar trade and money management, how successful traders approach the market, and so much more. Get this trading course for free right now. Click on the very first link in the description to get this whole complete trading course to give you the edge on your side of trading this market. Do that right now, and I'll see you on the other side.